Um, hey you guys, uh, my name is Evgeranos and I would like to, to share my experience with uh, PRK eye surgery which I had uh, almost exactly a year ago and I would like to you know um, lay down my experience for those who are undertaking or thinking of taking this uh, specific surgery. I didn't have a LASIK. Um, I, I've heard that it's a lot more painless and, you know, frustrating to deal with. So I'm going to be talking about PRK. I had PRK, um, because, you know, I think my cornea, well, my cornea layer was, uh, not thick enough, uh, for my, um, for my, uh, myopia degrees. Um, so... Once you know, once you you uh, enter the uh, surgery room, you are uh, uh, you're given some anesthetic drops for your eyes, which kind of make them numb. Uh, not that you know the whole surgery hurts at all. It's just annoying. You have uh, things in your eyes, and you know you want to blink and stuff, but you can't. Uh, after after the, the drops, you are laid down onto the surgery table. It's uh, fully automatic. Um, the do the doctors uh, may or may not have, you know, a cutting machine for your eyes. Uh, cutting machines? No, I mean a, a, a cornea circular, you know, uh, scapula or whatever. I, I don't know what it's called. You know, I don't have that kind of uh, information available. Anyways. What they do after the anesthetic drops and you lying down on the table is they remove a, a really thin layer from the uh, top of your eyes and then they go ahead and scrape that off and next they bombard your eye with uh, some uh, surgical accuracy laser which uh, adjusts your, uh, your new, you know, of course, I'm not a doctor, and I don't know how exactly this works, but it just, you know, brings um, a part of the back of your eye correctly, so that it, you know, uh, you can you can see, actually, without glasses, it, it almost does exactly what the eyes do, the glasses do to your eyes. Uh, the whole procedure for each eye is about ten minutes. It was uh, ten minutes for me. Um, after that, I could immediately see uh, a really big difference. I could, I could actually read the hour, but my eyes were really sore and um, I was really teary, and it was like I had a lot of marijuana. Um, you know, uh, the rest of the day because I had the surgery in the morning was hell totally. Um, for those having PRK, not Lazig, um, you know, <laughs> it hurts. <laughs> It hurts the uh, first two days, but once uh, these two days are by, it's, uh, you know, walk in the park. Uh, you wake up the third day and you're totally fine, and that's uh, what most people want to know about. Uh, the recovery time and what you're going to expect during it. So I had uh, surgery in the morning. Uh, for the rest of the day, all light sources from the house were, you know, completely shut down every every window uh, was closed all the curtains uh, drawn you know your eyes are going to be really really sensitive to light uh, so you don't want to strain them at all uh, in front of a PC or something uh, you are going to be given some uh, relief drops which uh, you will be applying really really um, you know uh, all the time all the time about I was uh, taking them about three hours every three hours, uh, two drops. Yeah, the recovery time is just this drops, drops, drops all the time. Um, so I remember I spent a lot of my time sleeping. Uh, you are going to be given a mask to protect your eyes during your your sleep. You don't wanna touching your eyes at all. Also, no water on the eyes uh, during baths and stuff. Um, the less you touch your eyes, the better. If you if you can just go by those two days without touching your eyes at all, you know that's the optimal thing to do. So uh, the first day of the surgery, you know, I slept. The second day, mm, 
I had some podcasts ready on my phone to listen to to help uh, time go by. Of course, you can uh, invite friends, you know, um, spend time with them. Um, and I remember the second day of recovery being exactly the same in terms of uh, soreness, tiredness, you know, I was tearing a lot. And it. Uh, it's the eye, you know, it doesn't need to hurt to, to bag you, to, to bug you, you know. Uh, even the, the slightest itch could, you know, drive you nuts, but you always have to keep in mind that you have already completed the surgery, it's done, so you just have to wait it out. And that's uh, what, I, what I did. I was really cranky because of the constant uh, pain and irritation. But the third day... I remember I woke up a totally different person, you know, by the time I woke up, I opened my eyes and the irritation and the pain was gone, you know, it was completely, it had, it had completely disappeared, it was uh, sort, of, sort of magical, like, you know, the previous day you were like shit, and the next day you were okay, so yeah, and there was still some irritation going on, I also still had the, uh, bandage con contacts on you know when you complete the surgery they put some contacts on your eye which uh, accelerate the healing so of course uh, I didn't take these off on my own I went to my doctor who removed him uh, who removed them himself but you know total recovery time um, at least for me I can't speak for everyone everybody's uh, organism is different was three days so PRK recovery time three days um, after that after um, uh, on the fifth day I went to remove my contacts and it was painless for the most part but after I, I removed them the doctor explained to me that you know uh, on underneath the contact uh, some uh, cells from the cornea had you know, had been removed while removing the lenses, so it hurt a bit, uh, but nothing compared to after the surgery. So the next day was perfectly fine. I could, uh, you know, I could use the computer from the third day of the recovery, but it was kind of blurry still, even if it didn't hurt or I didn't have any uh, light uh, sensitivity or anything. So that's uh, really good. Um, but yeah. Yeah, uh, now I can see perfectly. I think I have uh, 20 out of 20, I'm not sure. But I can see perfectly and I feel after one year as if I have never wore glasses in my life. And because I have been wearing them from first grade, you know, um, I just, you know, I I had these habits like uh, leaving the, the glasses on top of the... Uh, on top of the table next to me while I slept and after the surgery the surgery I was keep uh, searching for the glasses or when I took a bath I used to always remove my glasses and I still do it from time to time to be honest it's it's real strange uh, taking a swim without glasses is like heavenly it's amazing it's uh, you guys if if you uh, you're considering and you have the budget absolutely go for it it's a life changer I'm not talking about people who have like one or two degrees and can live without glasses and just wear them occasionally when reading or driving in the, uh, at night but if you if your life if your everyday life um, depends on wearing glasses just go take the surgery it's just you know if you're taking PRK if you're as unlucky as me in taking PRK it's just two or three days um, recovery time it's nothing compared to a lifetime believe me so if you find if you found this uh, video helpful, please leave a like, uh, show some appreciation. If you didn't, you know, just just can um, comment on what you didn't like, uh, help me improve, you know. Um, and thanks a lot for uh, for watching. This is Afghanistan, and have a nice day.